All right, this video is for Jet Guy 1250, and I think that um, because he wanted to know um, about this whole boat that I'm making, I figured that I'll make a series. Well, I wanted to make one regardless, but I guess I could start on early. I wanted to wait till I finish, but that's okay. I can start right now. All right. Um, basically, what I did was I downloaded this program called SketchUp. It's from Google. It's free, and I use it to basically design my boat and this is my boat right here I'm using my frame I'm framing it with um plywood and then I'm coming over it with some fiberglass but this is the boat right here and and I wanted to make it to fit in the back of my trucks where I won't have to have a trailer so this thing fits snug I mean perfectly perfectly in the back of my truck like six foot by five feet wide, yeah, five feet wide and six feet long. And look over here, this is how you're supposed to sit in it. Well, you would be lower than that. Right now, it looks like there's some kind of high in the boat. It's like top heavy or what have you. But, but I couldn't manipulate these people, so so don't worry about those. You, you fit way better than that than that. If I just turn this layer back off, I'll be okay. Oh, great! Now the computer want to act up. Okay, um, and from a, and I wanted and I was inspired by a pedal boat because those things are pretty expensive. So what I wanted to do was make a pedal boat, and so since I didn't have the money for that, I figured that I'll just make my own. But I got lazy as usual, and I left the space out for a reason you wanna know why because of this baby right here yes that's my motor that I'm gonna use that's my predator motor I'm, I'm gonna use but I started off using well I did all my plans with the harbor freight motors this bad boy right here which is the exact same thing as the predator engines you know and I have you know basically everything else the chain the propeller which is right here the shaft the motor mount which I'm going to use um, sprockets shaft what have you and basically what I did was I drew everything up on this computer first and then everything that you see right here see this little ugly um, wannabe propeller right here and the shaft would have you connected to the motor that's what you're looking at right here so I designed it in the computer first and then I've uh, decided to make it so that's what we have for part one so um, yeah so if you plan on designing a boat I mean not just the boat but anything download this program it's very easy to use and if you need help in, like trying to use this program just let me know it's real simple but um, this is the plan and it looks well, one thing about one thing that I don't like about this program is that it makes everything look out of proportion. Like, it doesn't look this proportional. It's it looks more proportional, in other words. So, I'm gonna um, end this video before it get too long and I won't be able to upload it. So, uh, stay tuned for part two.